Pierpon School students and teachers, you are amazing. You collected over $3,200 to purchase farm animals, pigs, goats, and cows for our children of the St. Lawrence School in Majero, Uganda, through an outreach program called Funds for Farming. During my trip to Uganda this summer, I met with some of the students from St. Lawrence School who received their animals through your Funds for Farming project. I'd like you to meet some of them, and one in particular, Patricia, has a message she'd like to share with you. Dear Pierpont students, I'm Patricia Pierpont, and I'm very happy to I have a goat mm. and he's a big goat oh. and it is very nice goat. A nice goat? Mm. Nice. Aisha has two new baby goats. They're one month old. Let's say hello to Semaganda Matthias, who received a goat from the Funds for Farming program. I thought it would be interesting for you to learn more about Semaganda and what his home life is like. So he's going to take us there now. We're walking down the path, and on the left you can see sweet potatoes growing. I would like you to meet Semaganda's mother. Her name is Jessica. She's a very hard-working woman. She is responsible for raising the food on the farm for her family. She's also the mother of seven children, so she has a very busy life. This is the kitchen where Semaganda's mother prepares the family's meal on this stove there on the right. Let's continue on now to his home. You can see it's thatch roofed and it's made of mud and it's very dark inside. So he's going to take us in and show us his bedroom. It's uh, in the back and it's quite dark and I'd like you to notice that he's going to show us a mosquito net. So all the children in Change of Life Uganda also receive a mosquito net to protect against malaria. Let's learn more about Samaganda from his teacher and his social worker, Rabina. <laughs> so, this is Samaganda Mathias. He goes to St. Lawrence Primary School for Studies. He's now in grade 5 and doing so well. Uh, Semaganda starts his journey in the morning at 5. He reaches at St. Lawrence at around 6.45. Because when he, he goes lessons at St. Lawrence begins at 7 sharp. So he has to be there before seven so that he can attend the lessons. Mm. Matthias, what is your best subject? My best subject is uh, science and mathematics. Where are they your best subjects? Because I want to be a doctor. You want to be a doctor? Yes. Okay, what is your best sport? My best sport is football. So, <laughs> Matthias uh, takes care of the goat. Uh, here in Africa, goats are not taken to feed very early in the morning. You first wait for the dew to dry off the grass. So they are taken from 10 up to like 1. That's when they are taken out to graze. Oh. Is it a female? Yes, it is a female goat. Uh, it gave birth to the first kid and unfortunately it died and it is now expecting oh. to get another. So let's say goodbye to Samaganda and go on to St. Lawrence School where I met with some of the students who brought their animals to school so I could take pictures to share with you. I'm to meet the students of St. Lawrence School and you can see some of them who received animals. These are the goats and we have a message from one of the students. Dear Pen Post Pay Pot students, we thank you for the contributions you gave us and and we 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 thank your teachers for the for organizing this this project and we make sure we, we should care we can care for it 
and it, we can buy other projects. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And what is your name? My name is Nanyonjo Faith Aida. Very nice message. Does anyone else have anything they'd like to say? Uh, Tony also has to something. Is this Tony? Hi, yeah. Tony. Dear paper students, thank you for your contributions. Thank you for all things you have given us, and we, we shall take we shall take care that the, the goats are well and and the medic, me, medical and we shall take medical checkup for it. Uh -huh. Thank you for your contributions. We shall we shall take care that it reproduce and we get and we sell them for. Okay. How do you care for a goat? But what's, what's involved? By, by we vaccinate the goats. Uh -huh. Oh, you have to vaccinate them. Omlala. We give it feeds. What do they eat? They eat grass. Uh huh. Banana peelings. And and some and some leaves. How uh -huh. much? Um, when you sell the offspring. Do, how much money do you think that you would get? How, how, much, how many shillings? One hundred thousand oh, shillings. A hundred thousand shillings, that's pretty good. And what would you do with a hundred thousand shillings? I save some money and I use some to buy some scholastic materials. I see, okay. Well, thank you so much. Can you all say goodbye to Pierpont School students? My love. Bye. Goodbye. Uh, Thank you. As a result of your kindness and your generosity in helping with the Funds for Farming program, our children are learning how to raise a healthy animal, how to sell the animal in the market, to open a bank account, and to save for the future. The students you are helping will have funds if an emergency arises or just for some of their school needs. They send a big thank you and are so happy to be your friends.